फर्स्ट फिल वाटर इन द वाटर कंटेनर अप टू द मैक्सिमम मार्क टू द बैक ऑफ योर एस्प्रेसो मेकर फिल्टर होल्डर एंड हियर इज द फिल्टर वी आर गोइंग टू पुट आवर ग्राउंड कॉफी इनटू दिस फिल्टर एंड टैंक इट एंड टैंप इट नाइसली द मोर प्रेशर यू अप्लाई एंड द बेटर टैंप इट इज द बेटर विल बी द क्वालिटी ऑफ espresso shot that you will get tamp it nicely make sure that none of the coffee ground coffee is is there on the side of the rim clean it well put it into the espresso maker till and bring down the sleeve so that it is fixed in place now plug in your coffee maker and switch it on put a nice wide mug to collect the espresso which comes out from two spouts you can also use two smaller mugs now the light has turned green and put it to brew mode you can see that the espresso has started coming out from two spouts it will be darker in color initially as the time passes it will become light in color dark blue which is getting collected in the mug let it brew Turn off the brewing. See some some brew is still coming out. You can see this dark espresso is what you will be using to make our coffee. See this will be adding heated milk to it. We will be frothing some milk to put in. This is the milk frother steamer. We turn the knob to the steaming side, and then move it, move the milk up and down in the cup. Make sure that the bottom of the the spout never touches the cup. It's always about a centimeter above. By moving it up and down, you can create a stiff froth. In this case, we are just looking at heated milk. So we will not be really doing for too much of that. Bring it back to the off position. Our milk is ready. We will be adding our espresso shot. If you want it to froth. Taking half of that espresso. Is that which was enough for two? Adding it to the. Taste. Just mix everything together. very own latte art.